Good morning, everyone. Let me speak today about the rule of law, which is a big issue discussed by ministers in Brussels this week, but rightly of concern to all Europeans at this moment. When we say that the rule of law in Europe is at risk, what do we mean? Laws are made by parliamentarians with a democratic mandate. They are executed by public institutions. But they are defended when I, as a citizen, have a concern that my rights are violated by independent courts. Before courts, from the lowest to the highest, from the district court here in Berlin to the European Court of Justice in Luxembourg, the assumption is that every citizen, the unemployed worker, as much as the most powerful minister in a government, will be treated equally. If courts and judges in those courts can be put under pressure or instructed or punished by governments of the day because they don't decide how the governments wish they decide, the rule of law breaks down in each democracy, but also at the European level. Because in the end, what is the European Union? but a voluntary association of sovereign democracies that are sharing the power to make some laws together, which then apply to all, to be enforced in courts. This is what the debate is all about. Can we, as citizens of Europe, can European institutions defend our right to have an independent, impartial hearing before our courts?